Hello, my name is Chou Xiaolong. I'm the author of the Inspection series. And the Dancer for Chema Ma is one of the books in the series. And it's the first one to be made into a comic book. First, I just wanted to write a book about the Chinese society in transition, but I had some problem with structure, so I changed the novel into a crime novel, but the main character, Chen, become an inspector. He was an intellectual. Now he is intellectual as well as a cop, because I want him to think not only who did it, but also why and how you know, this tragedy happened in China. Now, the dance for Chen Ma Mao is number, number six in the whole series. One question I had about things in China is Mao, because even today, the shadow of Chen Ma Mao still lingers in China. There are still some fervent supporter of Mao, even though officially the government say he made mistakes, but he still good, something like that. So I, in this book, one thing I want to deal with, how to deal with the shadow, the evil shadow of Chen Ma Mao. This is my first comic book, graphic novel. So I'm really excited. And uh, I, I hope you know, my French reader or readers elsewhere will like it. And they will also see in vivid details of how things like. Because without pictures, some people can only imagine, right? How things will be like during the Cultural Revolution, how things will be like in today's China. But this is wonderful, it's wonderful. I used to write poems. So when I first start writing a novel, I want the main character also write poems. Now it's a tradition in classical Chinese literature. We have novels, but in the novels, we also have a lot of poetry. And for me, I think it works for another purpose as well because I want this main character, the cop, not only to examine things from a cop's perspective, but also from a poet's perspective. And for this particular book, The Dancer for Chen Ma Mao, it happens Mao also wrote poems. So not really good poem, but he still wrote poems. So that's also like, you know, make the inspection, see Mao in a different perspective as well. Some of my books have been translated back into Chinese, and I, I believe you know, there are some impact. But you are also right, they change a lot. Politically sensitive sentence will be gone. Even the Shanghai, you know, the background of my story is also becoming each city in Chinese. So I think the logic for them is, you know, the bad thing cannot have happened in China. But for this one, I don't think, you know, the dancer for Chen Ma Mao, I don't think they will translate back into Chinese. It's too, too sensitive for them. <laughs>